Now, the most accurate weather team in Florida, ABC Action Weather. How you doing, everybody? So the rain started earlier across the area on Wednesday. We had the heaviest storms east of I-75. In fact, pretty much mostly in Highlands County. And then as we go through the overnight, things begin to wind down. I do think we see some morning showers along the coast and then everything begins to bush inland by later on in the day. Pretty much exactly what we had on Wednesday, just maybe a little more of it on Thursday. Friday, then at that point, I think we start to see a change and more of an east to west flow arrives by later on Friday into the weekend. And that means more sunshine Saturday and Sunday until three or four. And then the storms develop in the east side of the state and they all blow back toward the coast later on in the day. So here's a look at Florida's most accurate seven day forecast. So we're going to keep rain chances at about 40% on Thursday and Friday. Now they bump up to 50 or 60 over the weekend. Again, that's kind of a scary number, but it shouldn't be. It's just kind of the pattern which gives us a lot of sunshine until 3 or 4 o'clock and then a better chance of more widespread storms starting at 4 or 5, kind of like what we usually see in the summertime as they all come back toward the beach.